Warning, I, Dan Lanks, am going to completely blow your mind during this Minecraft video. So if you enjoy console Minecraft, hit that like button and subscribe for more block placing awesomeness. Yo, what's up guys? It's Dan Lags, and I am back again with another episode of tours here in Danville. And today, uh, a lot of people requested that I tour some of the restaurants in Danville. And I know you guys see the McDonald's off in the distance over there, but that is not what I'll be touring. Um, I'm actually going to be touring this like modern cafe, a uh, little miniature restaurant kind of thing. And uh, as you can see guys, um, this is one of the restaurants in Danville. There's like four or five of them, maybe six. And uh, I think this is my personal favorite one. Uh, just because it's kind of got like that homey feel to it and it's uh, it's really really um, contemporary you know so uh, we're gonna get started uh, basically this is the front here and it's got kind of this pathway that you can walk through over here and come all the way down and this is obviously oh my god what the hell anyway <laughs> this is the uh, the aquarium basically and there's some squids in here but they're gonna die out really soon because for some reason the squids are glitched on um, Minecraft on the Xbox, where if you place a spawn egg for a squid, they tend to disappear after a little while. But basically, this glass wall or this ice wall is actually an aquarium on the other side, but it also looks into the uh, inside of the cafe. So we'll, we'll go inside right now. And uh, colors I chose for this was snow, clay, gray wool, and cyan wool. And these squids are blowing my mind right now. What is going on? So we'll go inside. This is the main entrance. And as you can see, this is a little waiting lobby kind of. Um, it's got like a nice tall ceiling with an ice or yeah ice ceiling and uh yeah those sitting areas and then this is the uh the main room of the little cafe and if you come over here it says on the registers the back of the registers it says welcome to the danville cafe and also you guys may notice that uh there's a lot of item frames and paintings in this cafe and for some reason i was able to place um item frames and paintings again when i was building this um, i'm not really sure why it just kind of worked like that. So basically what I did was I put item frames on the chairs and then I put um, fences on the chairs and put them upside down. So it looks like um, kind of like the side, like a, like the side uh, handle thing. I think it looks pretty cool like that. Um, just kind of some inspiration for you guys. And these squids are still rampaging. Like it looks like they have like a all out brawl over. Like can't you spread yourself out? There's so much space over here. You retards, my God. Anyway, so... Yeah, this is kind of the main room. Obviously, we got a whole bunch of sitting areas, and these are probably the nice seats because you could sit and like this uh, wall works as again, like I said, an aquarium and a window, so it's kind of cool. There is water in there, believe it or not. That's why the squids are floating around like that. And basically, out here is just a little courtyard, or it's not really a courtyard. It's kind of just like a little outside area. And as you can see, if you fly out here, this is kind of like the uh, the street dining, you know, like you can just dine right on the side of the street. And this is kind of a residential area, so um, it's pretty convenient that they have a little cafe in the middle of their little residential area. And more, most of the uh, businesses and um, restaurants in Danville are in like kind of like one area. It's kind of like a corporate area, but right here is like the biggest table, and it's got some bookshelves and stuff behind it, so it's kind of homey. Looks looks pretty nice. Again, this is the register. If you want to come inside here, this is like where people chill and uh, you know ring up ring up the customers and stuff like that. Welcome to the Danville Cafe. May I take your order? Yeah, they're much happier than the McDonald's employees. And uh, in here is the cook or the kitchen or whatever. Uh, pretty small, pretty simple, really. It's just kind of I put some furnaces down right here and just some cauldrons. I mean, I didn't leave a whole lot of space on this on purpose because it really wasn't that big of a deal. It's not really that necessary. And yeah, that's basically it for the uh, inside room, I guess. We'll walk out here. This is another courtyard area. that has got some fences above for protection. This actually does block you from the rain, believe it or not. Believe me, it rains a lot in Danville. It may not seem like that because it doesn't rain in the tours, but it rains a lot in Danville. Don't you worry, guys. And we got some more seating out here if people want to just relax and have, have a good time here at the Danville Cafe. So basically, over here is kind of like a little ice sculpture that I built. It is honestly the most random spam placement of ice ever, and it's a little bit weird, but you know, I thought it, I thought it was a kind of an interesting idea, and then if you fly over here, it actually says cafe, and then there's a little L on the wall up here that stands for lags. So we have the uh, symbolize, symbolize that this is actually a cafe and not a house. You, you could mistake this for a house, like a modern house, but I think I made it pretty uh, noticeable that it's not a house, you know. So over here, I mean, you just walk around. This this is like kind of like the back entrance, and if we just come up here, you know, we got the uh, the roof of the restaurant. It's pretty pretty straightforward, really. Just kind of like large structures and um, large support pillars that connect to each other, really. 
It's a pretty simple design. Only, it didn't, only took me about maybe an hour to build this. Not, not even that long. Um, but it, it looks nice. It's really simple. It's a good addition to a map if you guys are looking for inspiration. And this is, again, the pathway that connects from this road. So there's a whole bunch of ways to get into the restaurant because this is not like... This is like a walk-in restaurant, not like a drive-in. So you, there's no parking lot. But I made sure that there was many, a path, many pathways. So there's I think there's four pathways that enter into the restaurant. So, um, guys, that has been Dan... It has been Dan Lags. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, Danville is very close to being done. Um... Just any day now, it's going to be up for download. So just stay patient, guys. Um, again, it'll be... I'm going to make sure... It, my God, look at that squid. I'm going to make sure that um, it's up before TU12. So uh, so you guys can download it before TU12 comes out. So just have something to do in the meantime before... Total update 12 hits us and we have uh, some fresh stuff to do on Minecraft on the Xbox. So it has been Dan Likes. Make sure you click that like button if you did enjoy the video. Again, helps me out a lot. Helps my channel grow and that's always a good thing. And uh, it has been your friendly neighborhood, Dan Lags. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this tour. And I will come back at you guys tomorrow with the second episode of the Ultra Modern House 3 Let's Build on that new seed. So stay tuned for that. And that's pretty much it, guys. So hope you guys enjoyed this video and this little modern cafe. Hopefully you guys got some inspiration. That's awesome if you did. And I will stop talking and see you guys on the next episode. Peace out.